the whole idea of uh, uniting the personal story and the uh, history, uh, the story that tells us uh, the history, is very good uh, for students that uh, because they can remember better to uh, connect the personal story with the uh, his, uh, historical uh, data. It was the best for me um, when we guided the students of our school for the exhibition. I saw that they were really interesting. I guided, I think, 25 groups for the exhibition and no one talked while I was talking and they were really interested. They looked with open eyes. I saw that they moved them, what did all those Jews have to went through. I realized that this has a big influence on my life. Maybe not as big um, as it may seem, but um, I learned a lot of new things. It did give me a better insight into what happened during the Second World War. I didn't know some of these things before uh, this workshop and exhibition, that it, which I do now. Uh, my opinion did not really change, but I learned a lot, much more than I learned in, at school. After all, I like the workshop. I don't know. I think it's, it's, it's well done, and I don't know whether you have to change anything. Um, do you think that we are um, more connected now? Yeah, it, absolutely. Why? Yeah, because uh, we spent two days uh, together working, um, experiencing something new, and I think that uh, um, we became friends. We should have discussed better the the extra topics and the the extra panels with the partisan. We also had a couple of posters which represented the concentration camp in Lubel, Leubel, and uh, people were were especially interested in an extra. Um, event which we had on our school uh, two survivors from second world war came and we were talking about uh, their experience which was quite tragic and people were quite and touched the visitors weren't so interested in this part of exhibition about partisans yes but we had a, a workshop with one partisan and it was very interesting and a lot of people came and yes it was a nice um, presentation of the partisans and how did they um, survive You were at our school and we visited your school. We talked about a lot about the project and about the situation between Austrians and Slovenes. And I think it was um, really interesting to, um, to see what the Austrians think about us and what do we Slovenes think about Austrians. We discussed about it and we also looked at your film, I think, yes. I was a bit nervous uh, at first, but then it was all fine because because uh, uh, the visitors were uh, working with me I got, and uh, uh, a lot more confident in front of talking of people. Uh, I uh, learned how to explain uh, some things to people. And well, the point was to show the people that uh, every single human being has a right to. Um, to some kind of uh, respect, basic respect, and to show the part of the history which is not so brilliant and nice. Um, and to, it was kind of a wish, our wish, that this kind of things uh, don't happen anymore. Well, first of all, I was very proud of my students because they were really good guides and this was the thing that everybody liked because they were guiding them around the, the exhibition and everybody who saw it liked it very much how it was prepared um, the message that it was given so almost all our schools saw it so around um, two thousand um, around thousand students so they all see it and they like it very much so it was very nice. Okay.